Okay, good morning everyone. It is Wednesday. No, it's not. It's Thursday. And we're ready for speed drill eight. Have it done today. One, two, three, go. Okay, so let's jump in. MM, if you see over here, M equals 1,000, 
So if you have two M's, you can look in your box and you can just figure it out. If you have two M's, your answer would be 2,000. So this is in the thousands place. Alright, so we broke it into thousands. Now we took care of that. Now we're going to add C. What is C? You can either look on your chart or you can look up here. C equals 100. Alright? Maybe let me know if you're last and you can take this, you can write this out on a piece of paper and ask your mom what she thinks that number is and see if she can figure it out. <laughs> because if you know this code, you can figure out, you can write any kind of secret number in, in these Roman numerals and you can read them. Alright, X. What is X equal? Well, if you look in this chart, X equals 10. Now, these three are what you probably should know, because they'll be on clocks and I don't know where else they will all be. But these are the most popular ones. Uh, I, V, and X. Alright, X equals 10. Now, look at this one. It could be a little tricky to combine. Whenever they combine two Roman numerals, it will be in your box. You can always get in your box. If you want to figure it out, Notice that I is smaller than V, and the smaller one comes first. Whenever a small Roman numeral comes before a bigger Roman numeral, that means we subtract. So V equals 5, I equals 1. So 5 take away 1 is 4. Hopefully that makes sense. <laughs> okay, we'll come practicing it. If you look in your box, though, if you, you can find I and V in your box, and it'll tell you exactly what it is. If you go down one, two, three, four, if you find four in your box, it looks like I, V. Okay? Now, we can just write our number. This in the thousand. Oh, dear me. Butter fingers. Okay? So, we have thousands place. We have hundreds place. We have hundreds place. And we have, did I say it wrong? Thousands, one hundreds, tens, and ones. Because one place has one number. So our answer, 2,000 plus 100 plus 10 plus 4, is 2,114. This number equals 2,114. Let's go to number 2. MV111, or III. <laughs> okay, M equals what? 1,000. Go ahead and write 1,000. Alright, now let's go here. We have, now this is where we just figure it out. You can look in your box, but you can also figure it out if you know these. So we have B, 5, and then we have three I's. So 5, we are not going to subtract this time because the bigger Roman numeral comes first. So we're going to add 5, 6, 7, 8. We have 5 and 3 ones, which equals 8. Okay? We have 1,000 plus 8 is what? We have 1,008. We have a number in the thousands place, we have a number in the ones place. We put zeros in here as placeholders in the tens and the hundreds place. All right, let's do this one. It's so huge, but isn't it so great that they break it up for you? It makes it so much easier. M equals what? What do you think? 1,000. D, C, C, C. Let's see. <laughs> oh, it's quite rhyming. Okay. D equals 500. So the bigger Roman numeral comes first, so you know we add. So we have D, 500. Then we have three C's, and one C equals 100. So we have 500, 600, 700, 800. Do you see how I found that? If you look in your box and you find 800, go find 800 in your box. Look right beside it. It says D, C, C, C. So you can look in your box, but you can also figure it out. Now we have L, X. Let's look at this. L is 50, so it's bigger. So our bigger Roman numeral comes first, so we add. So we have 50 and we have 10. So 50 plus 10 is 60. All right? Now we have three I's. So it'll be one, two, three. All right, now 1,000 plus 800 plus 60 plus three would be 1,863. All right, I would like you to, to do number four and number five by yourself. How does this down look like? We subtracted here. I just want to quickly explain why. So, quickly again, when there is a smaller Roman numeral that comes first, you subtract. Let's say you have, okay, in number four, you have X and you have C. If you look at there, X is 10, C is 100. That means that the smaller one comes first, so we subtract. We have 100, 
take away 10 is what? 90. Okay? So that is one of your answers in number four. All right, do number four, number five by yourself. If it's too hard to figure it out, which you are so capable, if it's too hard to figure it out, look at your box and find the, the Roman numeral. 